All right, we are talking about fall curb appeal and also fall cleanup. So we brought Patrick Roy from Lowe's, who's going to show us some cool things. The, the thing that you just saw over here, this is one, this is one of the first things that we've got over here. First of all, Patrick, great to see you. My great friend. to see you. Always, always a great setup that you've got over here. You're going to blow our mind with some of these interesting well, hopefully, ideas. Hopefully, hopefully, no this pun intended. Is, right? Well, right, this so is a, a Lowe's exclusive, and I thought I'd bring this for you. This is a, uh, the Cobalt Cordless line. Now, this is the 80 volt max. This is the highest power in the industry. Um, so what this will actually do do is uh, it actually puts out 500 cubic feet per minute mm -hmm. of wind at 125 miles an hour. Uh, but with this new charge, this is the highest in the industry and a Lowe's exclusive. Um, but it's it's great. Feel free to try it out. Now, but I brought the whole line. And I have to ask you about this too. Now, typically people think of battery power or plug-in as being less powerful as gas power. Not but at that's all. That's not necessarily the case anymore. No, not at all. And uh, actually, uh, it's it's got a large battery, but it's still uh, very light and actually uh, it works pretty well. Uh, but the power is like nothing else, especially with the 80 volt. So uh, it's pretty impressive and it'll now, you know, actually with uh, all the leaves falling, mm -hmm. uh, this is a perfect time to clean up your lawn uh, and get going. I also brought the uh, 80 volt chainsaw because we actually have a chainsaw. It has that much power that we can actually go into a chainsaw. Uh, so this and you know, it's always been a thing with uh, cordless that you never had enough power, but this actually gives you 150 cuts per charge. And the amazing thing is this type of stuff is much less maintenance wise than having to get oh, those you cuts. have no no cords, no spark plugs, no gas, no oil. There's nothing to it. All you do is pop in the battery, start it up, and you're good to go. Cool. All right. Well, very, very easy. From the from the power tools to some of the stuff that people typically think about doing this time of the year, let's give them some of the ad advice on some of the things they should be doing right now. Absolutely, it's a great time to uh, reseed as you're going through thatching, cleaning up your yard. It's a good time to uh, go through and uh, touch up some of those areas that you may not have had uh, uh, great results with this year. So, some planting some grass seed is a good idea. Also, if you want to have any color uh, in your in your uh, coming up in the spring, now mm -hmm. is a great chance to time to plant bulbs. And I think people forget about that. This is the this is the Absolutely. season. This is the time of the year you're supposed to. And I uh, I brought a little bone meal just as a, as a tip. Put a little bit this uh, a little bone meal down when you're putting in your bulbs. You'll have some great color and smell and beautiful things in the spring nice. that you can go through. Um, and then uh, going towards a little bit more of a curb appeal. Sure. Uh, my great associates uh, Han and Justin uh, took a just a regular picture, but they painted it with chalkboard paint. Then Doreen came through and did the uh, uh, the uh, chalk on it. Uh, but something very easy can you can do. And this is just a paint. And this is just a paint that you. Can get you know anywhere. That's it, right at right at Lowe's. Okay. Uh, and then you just painted it on here, and then uh, you could wipe it off, and then all of a sudden change it for the season, so it'll be Christmas in a little bit. What's something like that cost? Oh, nine dollars. Oh, so it's not for a, for a quart. Then you can you know because everybody has those pictures that are sitting in a closet that you don't like or you never used. Mm -hmm. um, so you could just paint it up, and uh, and then now and you can lasts, decorate it, and it will last for absolutely, a long time too. absolutely. Fantastic. So then the next thing we made is we did a uh, raised garden uh, out of cedar. Uh, there's the cedar box. Uh, this doesn't have any treating or anything. We just put it together with timber lock screws, and I think we used. Used about eight of them on this, mm -hmm. uh, and then put uh, a lattice behind the uh, the trellis behind it and decorated it. But if you have a small patio in the front of your yard or somewhere, you can. This is a great way to decorate it, and again, you can change it for the seasons. For from top to bottom, something like this, which obviously looks beautiful. What what does it cost? About a hundred bucks is really all we did. Okay. And then you really can change nice. out the flowers and do the decoration. So maybe we could put a big Santa head there gotcha. <laughs> in time. But uh, right now it's decorated for Halloween because uh, we're right on the heels. Nice. Uh, and then actually our wonderful associates, Kristen and Christine, made uh, this beautiful plant. Box. Mm -hmm. And what they did is they just took this adhesive copper flashlight, yep. wrapped it around, and then we just used some furniture tacks. Oh, nice. And just decorated around it. So, again, $1.98 for the tax. Mm -hmm. And then uh, the, the copper was a little bit more. It's $39 for yeah, the yeah, copper. Yeah. Uh, but you could do three boxes with that. Sure. Uh, and then, of course, it's uh, pumpkin carving time. And we yeah. made our great uh, jack o lantern. And uh, my great associates, they uh, spray painted some cheesecloth, some hay to give it that old uh, look. And then, uh, of course, we sell uh, the Dremel kits this for carving pumpkins. This is something that's cool and a little bit different. I'm going to say, Patrick, my friend, this is cheating, but I really love this. And you can buy these things where, where it's a, it's a Pumpkin carving kit that's just a router. Oh, yeah. yeah. And and you can do that to be able to carve that. And that's so, how uh, Jason made that beautiful pumpkin. And then even, you know, you could even make a, a hardscape. Uh, I made this little uh, pillar, and you saw in uh, just a few moments just yeah, putting it, took it together. Five minutes or so to do and this. the block are $2.88 a piece. So, again, that's under $80 uh, for that cool uh, cool thing. And then I just brought another uh, a little tip if you uh, want to. We do also do sell a uh, glow in the dark paint. Um, so, we were thinking that's of cool. some ideas around the store of, you know, doing some hand prints and uh, glow in the dark, you know, obviously it wouldn't show up here, but over sure. Halloween, yeah, it's a cool, use, cool use a effect. Or something like that. Absolutely. Patrick, you're the man. <laughs> Sam, Thanks, thank you. Thank you so much. Uh, Patrick from Lowe's, more information on our website, WTNH.com. Go down to the on air tab, Good Morning Connecticut weekend section, and of course, Lowe's.com. You can go by in Wallingford and check him out too as well.
Yep. Patrick's the man. Patrick's got a lot of great advice. Let me throw my jacket on real quick and we'll uh, talk about this weather. We've got some beautiful views all across the state of Connecticut, 47 degrees. That's our temperature right now in New London. And uh, we're looking pretty good. 